More students across the Houston area are heading back to school. Paraline ISD is just one of the big districts that started kids virtually and in the classroom this morning. Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers joins us live in Paraline with more. Brittany, good morning. Yeah, good morning to you. As you mentioned, students in Pearland heading back to the classroom, but the district says that they're doing in-person learning with a phased-in approach, and it all has to do with students' last names. A new way to head back to school with masks and social distancing. But Pearland ISD has instituted another approach for in-person learning. Today, students with the last names A through F who chose in-person learning could attend classes on campus. Everyone else is learning virtually. Each day this week will look similar with students attending based on where their last name falls in the alphabet, except on Friday when all students will learn online. This is just another example of parents, students, and educators adapting during a pandemic. Today, Clear Creek ISD launched phase two of its reopening plan with pre-K, kindergarten, sixth and ninth grade, as well as groups of special education heading back to brick and mortar. Letitia Byer's son went to pre-K at Weber Elementary this morning. I like the fact that we brought the, the, the smaller ones in first just to kind of give them a little chance to acclimate, get themselves ready and then bring the rest of the kids in so that they can do their thing. While others were a little emotional at drop off. They say while their children are ready to head back, they've had to prepare in different ways. Of course, mask and everything has to be labeled appropriately. And I mean, they're taking a lot of precautions. They're separating the desk and it's different. It's a change for sure. I brought extra Germax. Um, they're going to be um, six feet away. And then Cameron has her own, you know, um, Germax and extra masks in her backpack. So here in Pearland ISD, students with the last names G through L can attend in-person learning tomorrow. Live in Pearland, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News. Brittany, thank you.